there is a beautiful sporting club right here in Madison Cav uh, County, Providence Hill, which hosts some of the biggest skeet shooting events in our nation. I took the short drive over there from WJTV to see the massive piece of land. All right, so when we pull up here, this looks like a pretty neat and beautiful place. Tell me just about Providence Hill. Sure, well, we're 1,200 acres. Uh, we're a sporting club, so basically a country club. We fish and shoot rather than play golf, and I guess the great newest thing is um, pickleball. So we don't, don't do either one of those, but <laughs> we're just a country club uh, for the outdoorsmen. Uh, we have two sporting clay ranges. We have... Uh, six feet test layouts, skeet, trap, halise. We do pheasant hunts, quail hunts, and we're located just outside of Flora or Pocahontas, Mississippi. Yeah, and how rare is this for the state of Mississippi? I, I mean, I, I maybe I just don't know, but this has to be one of the biggest, if not the biggest, club. We are. We're the, uh, you know, we're the biggest. There's several other uh, facilities in the in the state. The state has a really nice facility, but we're we're the only one of this type with a large membership that offers what we do. We're probably, I would feel safe to say, one of the top five or six places in the world as far as sporting clays. Uh, in in the world. In the world, we've uh, we've held world events. We've held the World Fee Task. We've held uh, four regionals. I don't know how many state shoots. And then coming up in April, I don't know what I was thinking when I tried to get it. We're getting the <laughs> U.S. Open, which is the second largest shoot in the world. Uh, we expect 1,600 shooters. We'll shoot a million targets that week. So i am been working actually before you arrived today. That's all I was doing is working on the U.S. <laughs> Open. Um, but yeah, we're, we're a membership club. Uh, you can, we have trophy bass fishing in three lakes. Like I say, we are, we have two sporting clay ranges. One has 14 stations, one has 13 stations. Uh, and we're open for our members to come out, bring guests and enjoy. And we also do a lot of corporate events. Yeah, only in Mississippi does a country club take a few different names. And there's not, you know, no That's golf, right. no pickleball. But hey, just, you know, come out and do the outdoors things. That's right. and, and that's really cool. So tell me more about, you guys have a clubhouse too. Sure. You know, you got, you, you, you got the outdoor stuff, but you also got some neat stuff inside. We do. So we're open for, we do corporate events every day of the week. But we're open to membership Wednesday through Sunday. We have chef here. Uh, we have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday lunch, and we have dinners on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I like this Sunday. We'll do a big Father's Day, have the chefs prepare a special buffet. Uh, so members have the, can come out and have dinner, have lunch, uh, organize a birthday party, just like you would in a, at another country club. We have that to offer, and plus, you know, all the shooting events. Yeah, and what's it like being out in nature, I guess, during a day, you know? It, it, it's got, it's got to be pretty cool to kind of always be out here. What's amazing is how sporting clays has taken over golf. Uh, huh. You know, golf has been being done and done and down. Now the corporate people really are enjoying bringing some clients, especially guys that haven't done it much, come out and able to see, get in the outdoors, and just taste a little bit of gun and garden lifestyle. And that's what we're offering here. It's not, we're trying to offer people experience they can get very few places around the country. Yeah, when you talk about this being kind of one of the premier places in the country, what are some other things that make you guys that? Well, you know, a lot of it I can't take credit for. God did. Uh, we were blessed with some of the, some beautiful territory, which you'll see. It's rolling hills and central Mississippi. Uh, you know, it just it wasn't hard for me to, to put a few <laughs> stations out there and make it beautiful. So I can't take all the credit there. And for you, what, what, what's kind of maybe your favorite part of this place? You know, um, of course, I, I, I love shooting sporting clays. So it's probably my is the sporting clays. And then in the winter, the hunting. Uh, get the, the quail hunting, I think, are is second to none in the state. And I really enjoy that also. How hard is it to shoot clay if you've never done it before? You know, honestly, we get the right instructor with you. I could have you by the end of the day breaking a lot of clays. You know what? I, mean, I, I might have to try that when we get off the well, camera and give, it, give it a couple of... another show one day. Have, <laughs> have an introduction to you for clays. How's that sound? Uh, you know what? I, I, I'm all for it. My grandfather used to do it in Montana. I used to watch him. I just there wasn't old enough to kind of go out there. And But, you know, he, he, he beat the heck out of my dad, you know, out there on the clay shooting. But, hey, thank you so much for doing this. Oh, you're so welcome. And, and you know, showing us around. You know, we, we really do appreciate it here at Live at Night. Well, I appreciate y'all coming out. I, I want you to come back to the Open and show people, you know, what kind, what kind of thing we're hosting for the state of Mississippi. It's going to be a huge economic impact for the state.